NIOSH approved N95 respiratory protective devices are the most common type of filtering face piece respirator, or FFR, used in U.S. workplaces. These disposable respirators form a tight seal to the face, removing particles such as bacteria, viruses, and dust from the air as you breathe through them. The NIOSH Respirator Approval Program is responsible for the testing and approval of respirators intended to be used in occupational settings. For NIOSH to approve a respirator, it must meet the requirements defined in the Code of Federal Regulations. These regulations include requirements on quality assurance, general construction, performance, labeling, packaging, and instructions. Because NIOSH-approved respirators meet these requirements, users can be confident in the level of protection that the device provides when it is worn and used correctly. There are many other products on the market that, sometimes falsely, claim to be equal to a NIOSH-approved N95 FFR. Some even claim to be NIOSH-approved when they are not. So how can you tell if your N95 respirator is NIOSH-approved? Respirators that have NIOSH approval will have specific labeling printed on the face piece. You may see some respiratory protection products on the market labeled as N95. However, if a product does not contain all of the parts of the required label, it is not a NIOSH approved respirator and therefore has not been evaluated according to NIOSH's strict testing requirements. This means it may not provide the level of protection it claims. The required labeling information on a NIOSH-approved N95 FFR appears on the respirator face piece or strap itself. This includes the name of the approval holder, which will often be the approval holder's business name or the private label name of another company that is permitted to sell the product under the same approval number, the part or model number, the NIOSH filter series and filter efficiency level of the respirator type, which in this case would be N95, the NIOSH approval number, which is written as TC-84A- and ends in four unique characters, and NIOSH in capital block letters. A lot number may also be on the N95 abbreviated label. If it is not found on the FFR itself, it will be on the product packaging. The lot number is required to be listed on the abbreviated label for NIOSH-approved surgical N95 respirators, which are specifically meant for use in healthcare. If you're still unsure about whether your respiratory protection product is a NIOSH-approved respirator, you can use the information from the label to search the NIOSH certified equipment list to verify the specific TC approval number and approval holder or private label company. This is the official listing of NIOSH-approved respirators. To search by the approval number, type in 84A- dash and the four unique characters printed on your respirator label. If no results are found, it means it is not a valid NIOSH approval number and the product is not NIOSH-approved. If you do not have the approval number, you can also search the list by manufacturer name or the private label found under the Advanced Search tab. NIOSH also provides frequently updated lists of all approved N95 FFRs by type and model or part numbers, which include the instructions describing how to put the respirator on correctly. After using these tools to confirm that your respirator is NIOSH approved, you can be confident that it is working as expected to protect you as long as it is worn and used correctly, forms a tight seal to your face without gaps, and maintained and replaced as recommended by the manufacturer. When demand for N95 FFRs is high, the number of products with false claims of NIOSH approval on the market increases, either through counterfeit respirators or misrepresentation of the NIOSH approval. The respirator classification N95 and the term NIOSH approved are recorded with the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office. Any misuse of these marks, including on respirators that have failed to satisfy NIOSH's regulatory requirements or have not received a NIOSH approval, is a direct violation of applicable trademark laws. Counterfeit respirators are those that have not successfully undergone NIOSH testing and evaluation themselves 
but were specifically manufactured to mimic a respirator product that did receive NIOSH approval. Similarly, misrepresentation of the NIOSH approval occurs when a product is falsely marketed and sold as being approved by NIOSH. Because misrepresented and counterfeit products are not NIOSH approved, they may not provide the expected level of protection. At a glance, there are several clues that you can look for to help identify if your product is counterfeit, such as, it does not include all the required label markings. NIOSH is spelled incorrectly. It includes decorative fabric or other add-ons like sequins. It claims to be approved for children. NIOSH does not approve any type of respiratory protection specifically for children. You can find more tips for spotting counterfeit respirators on our webpage. If you have concerns about your respirator being counterfeit or misrepresenting the NIOSH approval, or have questions about NIOSH approved respirators, please email ppeconcerns at cdc.gov. More information is also available on the NIOSH website. To be confident that your respirator is NIOSH approved, follow the tips and resources provided in this video.